Time waiting, slow, fast, and impulse in sound measurement. We'll be measuring sound using an A filter, but what makes it intriguing are three detectors, slow, fast and impulse that we have at our disposal. The differences when using them are best observed when we turn off the sound source from a set level, in our case 100 decibels, and observe how the level decreases. Slow, gray color on graph. You can notice that the measured level decreases gradually. It's like a gentle decline. Now, fast, indicated in pink. When we shut down the sound source, the measured level drops the quickest. A sound level meter set to a fast setting responds to changes in sound in 125 milliseconds. That's about 8 times faster than the slow waiting response. Last but not least, impulse, in yellow. It was originally designed to measure sound levels for short, loud sounds like gunshots and explosions. It was designed to mimic the human ear, which responds quickly to rising sound levels, but takes time to relax after the onset of such sounds. So, there you have it, time waiting in action.